Hi, Ms. Sherry. Ms. Hi. Um, how do you feel po na kayo po yung family na nire-recognize na? I can hear you. Now we can hear you. <laughs> How do you feel na yung family po nyo recognize as one of the most important people in set in the century of in the century? In the kasi, century, kasi uh, sinasanda or, or 100 oh, part yeah. of the hundred years of celebration. Ilang generations na rin po, diba? Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Yes. 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 <laughs> Say you for me, Sherry. Well, I'm very proud, mm. of course. Um, after all, I come from royalty. Mm. And my mom and my dad has been part of it since... I'm not going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> I just said I only be part of it. Uh, yeah, so, you know, my mom started her old mom. How old was I when I started? Well, uh, 15, imagine. Going on 16, uh, imagine. So, yeah. there you guys go. I mean, this is something that I think EDA um, has done so well for the industry. This is a series of, um, of uh, interviews to mm -hmm. showcase the rich history of our past mm -hmm. in film and to be um, honoring people who have contributed a lot of themselves into it. And I'm just proud to just be a sibling and to be a, an offspring, rather, of that, of that legendary couple. So, mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, the kids, you know, the arguments. Yeah. Eddie and I are very proud of them, right? The king and queen. You know, when I'm around with Shabi, I don't talk. She means that she doesn't. But when we're together, I listen. Truly, I think that I am grateful because the family has been a part of it. Pero sa pagdating po sa industry, parang pag sinabing Eigen Man, parang something na parang reliable talaga pagdating sa akin. How do you feel about that? That's what they think. <laughs> <laughs> reliable when yeah. it comes to acting. Yeah. Yeah, I must say, yeah, that's what I said about Nolan. Again, I'm very proud of the fact that they are being Mm. Here's a trivia. When I started with my brothers, it was a time when foreign names was not even um, welcome. Like they thought makamahirap yung silang pronounce. And I'm glad now that the, the, the offspring, the third generation, is carrying the real Eigenman name. So yeah, now we're at least known as that one name, Eigenman, which actually means the own man. <laughs> And that's how I do that name in my company, my own man. And if you do an acronym, it's M-O-M, mom. So, for example, own man, I get mine, and my mom. So, I like to play. Doon po sa word na, yun nga po sa family name nyo, parang sinasabi pag Eigenman, bawal hindi marunong mate. Totoo kaya yun? Totoo. Bawal hindi yung mate. Bawal lang hindi marunong mate. Sana. Hindi naman sa bawal, pag Eichen Mans. Sana sa industriya, bawal lang. Hindi marunong marte all together. I mean, after all, it takes a lot of years of training and sacrifice and heart, mind, and soul to get into the business as well as improving the craft. And because we love it so much, we try to do our best. So, I hope that whoever among the young ones now who have decided to step into the industry and they realize that it takes a lot more than just a pretty face and that it takes a lot of courage and guts to and discipline as well. So, um, yeah. Last na po, what do you look forward to pagdating sa film industry? I did, oh, I'm sorry, I don't, I think... What do you look forward to pa po sa pagdating sa film industry? What do I look forward to? Towards the, towards the movie film, yes. industry. Well, to be honest with you, I don't know really what to say about looking forward to the industry because I've been out of the business for some time now, about mm. 14, 15 years ago. Mm. So I um, not so much, uh, what can I say, uh, into what's really happening.
and age. As a matter of fact, I, as you were interviewed, Shiri, I was really bad. And I have to say that I am, I feel very honored to have been part of this uh, documentary mm -hmm. and uh, honored also that about my children. Uh, it's so much. Uh, What I truly look forward to are a lot of things that we've tried to look forward to many, many years ago, which mm -hmm. we're still trying to implement, albeit baby steps. Um, we've been infiltrated, basically, not infiltrated, but film festivals have propagated themselves, and we have now so many young filmmakers mm -hmm. coming out of the, of the, you know, of the field and, and, and really showing so much creativity and passion in what they do. And there's so many already who are willing. And um, on one hand, it's wonderful to have festivals that are giving them the platform to, to express their uh, creativity. But on the other hand, I really hope that they also be given for credit, uh, given credit where credit is due. Mm -hmm. And that we arrive at a place where the filmmakers themselves and all the creative people involved in making a film can make a living. A good living out of their mm -hmm. passions because it's still a job mm -hmm. and whatever it is they're still uh, being left to compromise limited with grants limited with um, exposure mm -hmm. and um, possibilities to, to be able to actually exhibit their films so maraming 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 kung dapat ayusin pero sana magkasama-sama na ang mga malalaki dyan the big sharks you know the theater owners the corporate owners the the festival owners, um, what else? The government? I mean, I hate to say it, but we need professionalization. Mm -hmm. And without that, we will not be able to be backed up by, by law. So for me, it will have, I'm hoping that it's gonna get there and I hope it will happen in my lifetime. Um, Ma'am, I'll get this opportunity because I'm going to start the start tomorrow. Yeah, I'm going to be 